Hi, it's Bougie Bree. I have some more stuff to show you guys um, in terms of collection videos. I hope you guys are liking this stuff. Um, I, I just, I'm really proud of my collection and the investment I've made. And, you know, like I tell men that ask me or people that are not into makeup, not necessarily men, but um, people who are not into makeup, they ask, why do you spend so much money? And I'm, I'll tell them, you know, what is it that you really like? And they'll say running. And I said, well, why do you invest so much in running shoes and clothes? And, you know, it's the same concept as far as I'm concerned. Anyway, today I'm going to show you my face palette collection and some of my larger highlighters and blushes, if that makes sense. So face palette collection, larger highlighters and brush blushes. Some of them are still in the packaging because I display them or I just got them. So anyway, let's get going. So um, the first one is the Tarte. Curtis Volume 3. When I first started into um, makeup, I bought the Tardis Contour Kit Volume 1, and I still am working on painting it, and I love it. So this one was on sale, and I purchased this one. And it has uh, a blush and a couple of bronzers, a contour, and a couple of highlights. So I really enjoy this. Um, you know, Tarte makes great products. It looks good on my skin. I really, really love it. This one is going into a palette rotation. It may uh, have already been. You may have not. Um, you may see this after the palette rotation for this week. This is the Physician's Formula, and it is called the Bronze Booster Shimmering Strobing uh, Set, I believe. And... Um, this is a great, even though it looks like a bronzer, it's great for highlighting for on darker skin, which is what I'm using it for. Um, I will say this. I don't own a lot of Physicians Formula because they do not cater to darker skin tones. And so um, that was kind of a weird purchase for me because I really didn't want to buy it, to be honest with you. I got this as a gift from Ulta. Uh, it came in the mail to me. And it is the Tardis um, Pro to Glow. I think that's what it's called. Yeah, Pro to Glow. Haven't used it yet. I got it in April. Don't shame me. But I was really excited. I got it as a gift. The next one is Pixie and Miriam. I don't know how to say the last name. Highlighter and Contour Palette. I got this off of Poshmark. I love Pixie. I just think they're too expensive. If I'm honest, you know, which I am. I try to be. This is also Pixie Book of Beauty Glow Getters Radiant Light. This is a highlighting palette. Okay. And this one I really liked. It was a good investment. Um, really good, actually. I was quite surprised. This is Sephora Illuminating Palette. I've used it quite a bit, if you can tell. I really like it. I really do like it. I was surprised. I didn't think I was going to like it. Now, this one, I cannot find anywhere it's a bronzer but i use it as a highlighter it's the city color timeless beauty see that when it when it arrived it was broken and i can't find it anywhere else it, it literally costs like two dollars i love it this is the tarte skin twinkle volume one a lot of people didn't like this i love it it looks great on my skin i use it in the summer mostly then I have the Smashbox Contour Palette, which I have had forever, and I have not used it. But um, it definitely caters to darker skin tones, as you can see, which I appreciate. This is the Vintage by Jessica Liebenskin. I don't know how to say that word. Um, beautiful colors for dark skin. I really like this. It's a highlighting palette. I got it in, I think, a BoxyCharm. This is the Sleek um, Highlighting Palette in Cleopatra's Kiss. Now, everybody wanted the Sleek Solstice. I didn't want that. I wanted this one. Look how gorgeous those colors are. This I got as a part of a holiday set um, a couple of months ago. Spotlight Palette drawn in, decked out by Smashbox. Trying to give you guys where you can see. This is an e.l.f blush palette it is in light but i can totally rock these colors let me see if it's better yeah i can totally rock those colors 
This is a highlight and contour palette by uh, IBY Beauty. And I like this came in the boxy charm. And I like it because it came with like an instructional thing. If you don't know, because a lot of people don't know how to contour. I I learned from one of these little paper things that show you where to place the powder. So appreciate that. Good job, IBY. Um, this I got as a present for myself because I really wanted it. Uh, I heard a lot of crap about it and I want to check it out. This is a Sweet Peach Glow Highlighting and Blush Palette. Okay, what else do I have here? I have the Sante Contour Powder and Blush Kit. Um, this is new. I got it on sale at Sephora. It was $23. It was one of those Wow Wednesdays or something, I think. And it is the, um, gosh, I love Tarte. This is their, um, what is this called? The Shape Clay Play Face Shaping Palette. Really love it. it. Smells just yummy. Any kind of product where Tarte has to do with like face products, I love. And I love their eyeshadows. They're just a little ordinary. Um, they're neutral. They're, they stay neutral. But their face products are awesome. This is a Strobe of Genius by NYX. Pretty good for the drugstore. I think I paid too much for it, to be honest with you. This is the Sephora Contour Kit. I don't know if you can really get the colors. There we are. This I've had forever, and it's in my rotation this week. I've never used it. It's, ugh, I've had it forever. How do you open this damn thing? Okay. It's the Too Faced Soul Mats, Soul Mates, Carry and Big. So I'm going to put this off to the side. Then I have um, a blush palette that I made from Coastal Scents. Very impressed with Coastal Scents um, blush products. This I've had forever. This is, I think, the Pin Up Girl by Tarte. Love Tarte blushes. Beautiful. Packaging can be a little bit overbearing, but I love Tarte blushes. This is the Anastasia uh, Glow Kit in Sun Dips. I couldn't remember if I had this one, but I used it quite a bit in the summer. You see that dip right there? Yeah, I used it quite a bit. Sorry. Then the next one is Anastasia um, Nicole Glow a Guerrero Glow Kit. I use this a little bit, but I haven't given it a really good, fair chance. I've used this one in the bottom a bit. Okay. But I will say it's good. A lot of people were concerned it was glittery. It's not. This is one of my faves also. This is the Makeup Geek and Kathleen Lights Highlighting Kit. Really nice. Got it on sale. Then this is the Pixie Ra Rosy Radiance Highlight Highlighting Contour Eyeshadow Eyebrow Kit. Also got this on sale. This was my first contour kit. I love it. I go hard for it. I will not throw it away. <laughs> it probably needs to be thrown away, but it is the Ulta Contour Kit. When I first found out what the hell contouring was. I had no idea what it meant, what it was, but that's what I bought. Next is, this is great. I can't, I haven't tried this. I don't know why I haven't tried this. The Ultra Strobe Balm Palette by Makeup Revolution. They're like a cream consistency. This one is the Makeup Revolution Blush Palette in Queen. I love Makeup Revolution's blush. I have one that I'm using right now. I love that. Okay, then I just bought this uh, two days ago. And it is the Kat Von D Metal Crush Highlighting Palette. And I would use these not necessarily as highlighters, but more as eyeshadows. Okay, and then we'll finish up with these. This is the She Bronzer, She Makeup Bronzer, Mineral Bronzer in Blush. Got that at the Beauty Supply. 
this is the, who is this? Oh, Nika K Sheer Glow Bronzer Face and Body. And it has several shades in it. These are now the larger, like, blush uh, or highlighters that I use. Okay. Like, for instance, this is a Color Icon Bronzer by Wet n Wild. And it is in... Uh, Reserve your cabana. This is not a bronzer for me. This is a highlight. Another one that is uh, to reflect shimmer palette by Wet n Wild. This would be um, a highlighter on me. And this is another one. Clean color bronzer shimmer. This is not a bronzer on me. This is a highlight. This is something that I really need to throw out, but I would like to try to see if it's any good. Um, this is Jeffree Star, so effing gold. I bought this before I knew, before I knew, so. And I'm, I feel a certain kind of way about throwing it away because to me that makes, it, it shows that, you know, um, that he wins because I threw it away and I still got, he still got my money and... I don't know. I just feel awkward about that whole situation. I'll, I just don't support him. This is a Wet n Wild Ticket to Brazil. This is also a bronzer that I use as a highlight. This is Wet n Wild. Now, this is actually darker color. What is this? Bikini Contest. I still use this as a highlight. Okay, and then I have... Now this I use as a bronzer, and it is the Rimmel Matte Bronzer. And then, now these, like I said, these are all the larger items that I have. This is the Essence Sun Club Matte Bronzer Powder for darker skin. Really good. Essence powder products are pretty phenomenal, to be honest with you. Oh, wait, I have three more. They're still in their packaging. This is... The Tarte Blush Bliss. It's a holiday palette. It's on display, so that's why it's in its packaging. But look at look at this. I need to take it out of the box. Look how gorgeous that is. Just get out of here, Tarte. Look at this. Mm. You can't tell me, Tarte, don't be doing it up. Because that right there, that's, that's real. Then this is the Tarte Blush Bazaar. Look at this outside packaging. Look how gorgeous. People say Too Faced has the best packaging. I really think Tarte has phenomenal packaging. This is an H blush and um, highlight. I think it's one, two, three, four, five, like 10. So it's eight blushes and two highlights. Here's the other side. Really phenomenal. And it was inexpensive comparatively. Then, I have been wanting this for eons. Um, and this year, I went and bought it. Or I bought it online. And it is the Tarte Blush Book Volume 3. Look at this. Yes, 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 yes. Now, let me see if I open this damn thing. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. What? What? That is gorgeous. That is... That is life right there. I like this one up here in the corner. And this one right here. And this one right here. Okay, so that's it, guys. That is my face palette collection. I will go on to do blushes and bronzers and highlighters will, will be done together. And, uh, yeah, so that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. Um, if no one told you today that they loved you, just know that I love you. Um, and, you know, you have a place and a value in the world. And, um, you know, sometimes it's hard to find it, but um, you'll find it. Uh, yeah, so just thinking of you, praying for you. And if you're not a person of prayer or don't believe in God, hey, that's okay. I can still pray for you, right? It doesn't hurt. It's not going to hurt you. <laughs> All right, thank you. Have a blessed day. Bye.